Welcome, teams, to the third installment of your first LEGO League engineering design process overview brought to you by Team Storm, first LEGO League 2015 Global Innovation Award winners. Their winning innovation, the Roy G. Biv app, helps teach math to children with dyslexia. The engineering design process is a cycle of practical steps you can apply to any problem. If your project involves designing, building, and testing something, as is typically the case in First Lego League, you will want to follow the engineering design process. There are many versions of the process. Some people use many steps, while others, like Team Storm, apply a streamlined version. Let's tune in to Team Storm and see how they apply the third step, design and prototype. Is there a real need for the solution? Having an innovative idea is always important. Coming up with solutions is really hard, and sometimes our list is pretty short. If you aren't sure what to do, you can consult your experts again. Engineers do not always follow the engineering design process in order. It is very common to design something, test it, find a problem, and go back to an earlier stage to make a modification or change to your design. It helps to have drawings or models so your team can really understand what you are proposing. We put all our proposals in writing so our teammates can take it home with them and really consider which idea is the best. If we have trouble agreeing on the best plan to select, we make sure we consider everything we will need to develop our solution into a prototype. Will we be able to do this on our own? We may not be able to build an app on our own, but we can create a series of colorful storyboards that demonstrate the function of each page. We relied on this approach for the Roy G. Math System. It is helpful because it gives a concrete image of what you're dreaming up to those with whom you are pitching your idea. Is it user friendly? Your solution should be simple and easy to use as possible, so that way you do not frustrate your consumers. Also, don't forget to document all the steps in the engineering design process by keeping a notebook of your research, field trips, and prototype development. This will make it easier to share with the experts along the way and the judges at your competition. Tune in for the next video in this series from Team Storm on the test and improve step of the engineering design process.